Marlene Jerome's 14-year-old daughter Wendy left their Rochester, New York house to take a birthday card to a friend. She never came home. Police found her body that night next to a dumpster near a school. The extent of the injuries are too horrendous to talk about here. What it is safe to say is that Wendy did put up a fight. It was Thanksgiving Day, 36 years ago. Wendy was murdered in 1984 when I was 11 years old. Julie Hahn grew up to be a prosecutor, the prosecutor who will now try to convict 56-year-old Timothy Williams of the alleged murder of Wendy. We'll take up Timothy Lee Williams. Williams waived extradition yesterday in a Brevard County Jail court hearing. He was arrested Wednesday after police found him in Melbourne. A police report says Williams lives at this address on Ganey Drive in Melbourne. No one answered the door when we knocked. A neighbor said she had never heard of him. Police say a new DNA test that identifies possible family members of suspects led them to Williams and perhaps to some answers for Wendy's mother, who every Thanksgiving crosses off the numbers of the years that have gone by. She's been wondering. Is the guy still alive? Is he dead? Marlene, I'm sorry it took so long, but we finally did it. Williams will be taken to New York within the next 30 days to stand trial for rape and murder. He is presumed innocent. In Melbourne, Dan Billow, West 2 News.